This is my math cast too. Created on 3-27-24. Intended audience was grade 3. Content or learning objective is to compare unit fractions by reasoning about their size using fraction strips. Created by Faith Villanov. Vocabulary. Unit fraction, fraction strip, and whole number. Unit fraction. A unit fraction is one part of an object or group of objects that are evenly distributed or divided. For example, as you can see in this picture, one half of the whole triangle is shaded in. So one out of two, one over two is the fraction for this triangle. For this square, one square is shaded in out of one, two, three, four squares. So one out of four. This one is the same way. One triangle is shaded out of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one over seven. One over seven. Fraction strip. A fraction strip is a tool to help students see that the same whole can be broken up into different equal sized parts. For example, one whole is equivalent or the same as one half and one half, and as one third and one third and one third, and so on with all of these numbers. Whole. A whole is all of a number that is not broken up into pieces. So, this bar right here, or strip, is one whole because it has not yet been divided into multiple strips. Each fraction strip is one whole. All of the fraction strips are equal in length. Color one fractional unit in each strip. Then circle the largest fraction and draw a star to the right of the smallest fraction. So, because this fraction says one fourth, we will be coloring in one part of the whole four. This fraction says one third. So we will be coloring in one part of the whole strip. This fraction says one over two or one half. So we will be coloring in one half of the entire strip. Now, Next up, we need to circle the largest fraction. One half will be the largest fraction because if you look at the length of each piece, one half is the longest piece colored in. Next up, we have to draw a star to the right of the smallest fraction. The smallest fraction is going to be one fourth because the box that is colored in is the smallest out of the three. Next up, circle less than or greater than. Whisper the complete sentence. Less than is when a fraction is smaller than another fraction. And greater than is the opposite. 
the fraction is bigger than the other fraction. For A, one half is greater than one fourth because one half is bigger than one fourth. Number B, one sixth is less than one half because one sixth is a smaller amount of a fraction than one half. C, one third is less than one half because one half is bigger than one third. D, one third is greater than one sixth because when you divide the whole into three pieces, each piece is going to be bigger than if you divide the whole into six pieces. Letter E. One eighth is less than one sixth. F. One eighth is less than one fourth. G, one half is greater than one eighth. And H, nine eighths is greater than two halves. This is because nine is a bigger number than eight. So this is a mixed fraction. So we will have eight colored in plus one eighth more versus if we have two halves, we only have one whole cover colored in. Lily needs one third cup of oil and one fourth cup of water to make muffins. Will Lily use more oil or more water? Explain your answers using pictures, numbers, and words. So, I added in this diagram, and I made it so we could see the difference in sizes. One third plus one third plus one third is one whole, or three thirds. One fourth plus one fourth plus one fourth plus one fourth is another whole, or four fourths. One third has a bigger box than the one fourth. So one third is greater than one fourth. Lily will use more oil than water in her muffins. This shows that the amount of oil is greater than the water. Thank you for watching. My MathCast resources were Google Images and Engage New York, created by Faith Villanoff.